We here have been taking different flavors of IS4 and friend. The honor takes 303. It looks like Diego took 325. Equal trade, all things well considered. Ghost Gunner and Diego, red team, south spawn. Both teams pushed up to the mill area now. Will be interesting to see how. How they kind of flex and react from this. I'm really trying to see where the potential is. Who's going to make the first move? Is there any opportunities that either team can exploit? But both teams playing a very standard 2v2 game here. Close formation, not separating, not overextending. Although it looks like Diego is... Ooh, there's a split here. General and the honor might make a push in. Diego... Yeah, that's bought time for the general to come round. Now Ghost Gunner and Diego. General, the honor takes another hit. General's pushed in very aggressively. I'm actually surprised that the Reds didn't barrel down into General on the crossing. Actually, the Honor gets one into the side of Ghost Gunner. Diego gets another one into General. Ghost Gunner's got one in the chamber. In through the drive wheel of General. Red team with a nice positional advantage here, potentially. But the effort is all going to be on Ghost Gunner. Ghost Gunner has got a very tough job ahead of him here. He is going to be locking down that flank. The Honor's going to be looking for shots coming across this. And he knows how to make that gun sing. And Diego... Nice bounce there off the mantle of the T-110E5. Pushing forwards for an aggressive spot. Bounces the side of the honor. The honor's coming back up for round two versus Diego. Diego needs to make sure that the honor can't get too far around on Ghost Gunner. General having to rotate. Look at this. Both players having to make sure that the... Well, both teams making sure that they're not getting pushed on and rushed. Whilst also looking for opportunities to do the same themselves. Ghost Gunner out trading General here very effectively. It's a nice HP lead to the red team, but it's only one shot when you boil it down to the reality of things at tier 10 heavy engagements. And I, oh, one for one, Ghost Gunner in general. And it's just Kami is here. Great to see you, buddy. The honor in general. Oh, General is looking very low. There is a well, there's a big weakness here. Of course, the risk is if you go in too aggressively, try and pick up the kill, it can backfire. You know, the General is still he's a two shot, and now he has to play super conservatively. And it almost looked like he got over that. Can you climb that? <laughs> can you climb that hill? Ooh, Ghost Gunner is on a flank. He's on a quick flank. If he goes too far, he's going to leave Diego at the mercy of the honor. And that that's that won't be fun for Diego. You better believe it. Looks like Diego's overexposing. No. The honor's pushing in on Diego. And it's one for one. Ghost Gunner bounces general. Ghost Gunner's moving fast. Looking to get round. And it's the first gun for the red team. Now Diego is in trouble. The honor needs to close down the T110E5. Diego needs to stay alive. At the very least, he needs to get one in before he goes. And to cap it all off, Ghost Gunner has capped off C. Gun advantage, cap advantage, red team. The honor, what are you made of? R2K, ready to kill's finest. One of the best players on the EU server. Will he crack under the pressure or will he deliver a masterclass in how it is done? I'm not sure. This is a tough situation for him. I, I mean... Against any other kind of any random noob you might come across easy win for the honor But these guys are not rookies Diego making sure he's as far away from the angry end of the honor as humanly possible Ghost gunner protecting C. He's got a hit point advantage uh, Easily a shot or two over the honor and um, he might be able to out brawl the WZ113 General played too aggressively too early on wasn't able to trade effectively with Ghost Gunner. He's left his teammate in a very sticky situation indeed. Now the question is, will Diego... Will he play aggressively? And potentially die, giving the honor an opening? Or is he going to be defensive, super strategic, not go for the glory? And that is a beautiful shot. Ghost Gunner, jinking with the honor, gets one in. The honor is... He's no longer trying to play cautiously. He is in trouble. 
And that is a favorable trade. Diego misses on Ghost Gunner. The Honor's looking to get round past Ghost Gunner and go for Diego. Doesn't quite manage it. Ghost Gunner to finish off the Honor. And that is GG. Ghost Gunner and Diego. 1-0 to the lads. Um, from US. Ready to kill trailing at the opening of the Grand Final 5th edition. Whew. <laughs> that was a good one. That was that was close. And we've got Mr. Nonstop. Highlander Shocky. Lovely jubbly. Same tanks. Nice. We've got Fort Despair. We haven't seen Fort Despair in quite a while. Um, I, this is the first time we're seeing it this evening, actually. Uh, but certainly, it's been done to death in the 2v2 format. They know what they're doing. They're not quite sure what to expect, though, from their opponents. Both of these teams, quite jammy, quite slippery. Never to be kind of underestimated or taken for granted what they're going to be doing. Look at this, the honor again. Tremendous speed on the WZ113. Secures that position early on, but not fast enough to deny Ghost Gunner. Getting the opposite spot, and Diego HT roll through the side there on the Honor. And the Honor takes another hit. This time from Ghost Gunner. The WZ113 really coming out. Um, <laughs> coming out not on top from that opening engagement. Red team with a nice, strong advantage. Um, about one shot, really in terms of overall hit point pools. And that's a beautiful shot from the general into Ghost Gunner. I have no idea how he made that. That must have been the tiniest of target areas. Diego misses General. General, a nice HE roll again. Superb ammunition choices for the general here. Really doing the, doing the business on this particular map. Um, the honor having to play a little bit softer now to begin and again oh the ghost gunner in through the side of general general is looking for the uh, reset on b diego did a wonderful job there oh my god free cam is just proving to be too much for me to control uh, on a wednesday evening diego capping b gets the cap pressure once again in the favor of the u.s clan uh, and team generally honored on the back foot less so in terms of hit points now they've seemed to have recovered the honors looking for a shot in on ghost gunner will he get it that's a tough angle certainly the gun depression there and the uh, like the nice dug in position but he makes it and that was in through the absolute like just above the gun that tiny top patch that slither of a target and he did it again oh the honor he is having his revenge that was superb. Ghost Gunner double tap. Triple tapped. Oh, the honor is the honor is showing off now. And General's having to come round to support the honor. Diego and Ghost Gunner are boosting the honor, but General's gonna finish off Ghost Gunner. And this could be a GG to R2K. The honor there with three almost impossible shots in a row. And that was a well, that was that was superb. And now the honor, he'll probably go down to Diego here. Um, unless General can get a shot in, he does. And now Diego is, well, he's going down. No chance. General, excellent turret rotation, tracking his target. Not much the T110 E5 could do to get out of that situation. Not fast enough. Um, and that is tied up one for one. No one's running away of it just yet. It's best of five, so it's only first to three. So with one one. Both teams needing two more victories, so two more games at least to play before we go uh, and find ourselves a winner. Same tank compositions. Oh no, same map. RN Jesus, what are you doing to us? Give us some variety. There's like over a dozen. But this is truly, truly a rematch. And it's, it's the same spawns as well. what relaxing music we have in the background general in the honor not playing a hard line on c this time 
playing a more kind of middling route towards B. Diego and Ghost Gunner taking the same approach that they took last time. They won't spot up anyone on C. General is going to go into B nice and early. It's going to be tough actually for the red team to get through to C without taking a little bit of damage there. Both spotted. The, honor's on, the honor is unspotted. For the first time, R2K have the cap lead. The honor in general can play defensively. They don't really have a massive situational advantage here, but I'm sure that if anyone can make it work, it's these guys. Ghost Gunner and Diego capping C, moving forwards. They want to make sure that the Blues don't slip away at the last possible minute. Diego and Ghost Gunner, though, very split. This is risky. They do have the terrain advantage in their favor. Ghost Gunner, he needs to get closer. I'm not happy with that level of separation. But it was a good connection from Diego into, um, into the honor. And the Reds again with a hit point advantage. Trading early effectively with the honor. He demonstrated what he can do if you give him even an inch. And the three shots into the top of Ghost Gunner on the last map. Well, that was a rapid, a huge shift in momentum. And speaking of momentum at the moment, the blue team have eventuality on their side. They can just sit and wait this one out. They don't need to play anything too crazy. As long as they protect B, protect themselves, they'll win when the clock runs out. The impetus, the need for change, the need to shift the dynamic of the battle is on the red team. The pressure is all on Ghost Gunner and Diego to make a move. But having to make a move on the likes of General and the honor from R2K, whew, my God, <laughs> that is not an easy task. Diego doesn't quite connect. General bounces on Diego. Ghost Gunner unspotted looking to rotate round the honor is spotted now everyone on the field is spotted diego and ghost gunner they could have got stuck into the general there i maybe or maybe i'm not seeing the train elevation no no it's a little bit of train elevation there and now red seizing control ghost gunner bounces general the honor doesn't quite pick up a shot oh diego gets another hit in the honors looking to connect with diego the honor in trouble no, no, Ghost Gunner making the classic mistake of looking for the wrong target. You need to be getting stuck into the ultra-low hit point tanks. Diego needs to get around the corner. Oh, General misses it. Ghost Gunner to finish off the honor. That would be a game changer. And now General has to close down Diego. He's going to give a free shot to Ghost Gunner. Diego needs to get one in at least. Does, but he's finished off. Now Ghost Gunner's got a huge lead on General. It's about 900 HP. No, it's not. It's about 400 HP. I can't count for shit. <laughs> Ghost Gunner, and again. Oh, but he doesn't quite manage to bounce that one. It's now 1,400 to 1,000 hit points. Red team with a minor advantage. They've got the cap lead. Not liking the position here for Ghost Gunner. I think General's going to come out better in this brawl. He's got the better angle. He's got the elevation angles in his favor. He's closed the gap. Ghost Gunner needs to, needs to sort this out. He doesn't want to keep engaging from here. Pulling back is a wise move. In and a bounce. But that was a good trade. 4 to 8 to 300 and something. Ghost Gunner. As long as he can stay away from the edge of this terrain, he won't be showing off his lower plate. And that is a beautiful hit. General down to 186. That was... I have no idea how Ghost Gunner made that. That was a very impressive shot. Red team now with eventuality. The quick cap stop on B through the cap pressure in the favor of red team general now with only 186 cap hit points in the tank has to try and do something to make matters worse ghost gunner is capping off b again both tanks spotted ghost gunner is he gonna try and use hc or is he gonna look for the perfect shot he's capped b now ghost gunner can give general the runaround general has to do something there's a hundred more cap points on the clock and then the red team are gonna win us are playing beautifully here i thought r2k almost had them then but diego got away got an extra shot into general and oh generals is he gonna come out sideways this would be a huge lapse in judgment oh he saw the elevation he saw ghost gunner rocking back up on the terrain and that's the time gone and ghost gunner oh he finishes off the general add insult to injury thank you very much yes please 
And that is Diego Ghost Gunner, Red Team. The lads from US Clan leading R2K. General in the honor. 2 1 match point now to US. First team to three wins at best of five. And this is, uh, whew. <laughs> this, is, this is some good stuff. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> And we're now, we're now waiting. Oh, it's a new map. I mean, I say a new map. It's, it's a new map for us this evening, um, in the fifth edition of the uh, the two versus two tournament. General in the honor, blue team, Southbourne. Making their way towards the medium flank, Ghost Gunner and Diego working their way into the city, splitting the distance between B and C. Slap bang in the middle of the city. That is a nice move by them, and they're not. No one spotted yet. Blue team, though, going for the early cap lead. Let's see here. Diego, Ghost Gunner, both spotted, not quite able to connect with General. Blue team with the cap lead. They can play passively here, but they really need to be coming out early. Well, coming out on top in the early trades, they've really been, certainly the Honor in general, they've been playing a little bit fast and loose early on with their hit points, and they're doing it again. The Honor caught out in the open. Um, nice shot, though, into Diego. And now the Honor, is he going to brawl? And now we're seeing, this is the first time we're seeing this tonight. It's an instant brawl situation. No hanging about. Great target priority though from Ghost Gunner and Diego. Burning down the honor in the WZ113 very quickly. And that is, oh, that's a huge advantage. This could be it. This could be the champions, could be Diego and Ghost Gunner. The honor went down so hard then, so early on. Like a minute and a half in and now General is one on two. And this is almost an impossible situation. He would have to play like a god to pull this one back. Doesn't go, oh, bounces Ghost Gunner. He's gonna get two in very quick succession. And this is a, is it Surrender? It's Surrender! Oh no. Oh no. Oh dear. It's Surrender. But fair enough, I mean, with such a huge hit point deficit so early on. One versus two. Um, there's, there's really nothing you can do. <laughs>